and we will see you guys when uh, when this dries out and then I will take the tape off and do the other side okay okay um, as you can see we got the uh, the blue done looks pretty good um, the black bag here is for to protect this side from getting sprayed from the color that uh, my buddy picked. And then here's this one. Obviously, you got a protected battery terminal, so it doesn't you know get all rained on and ruined. So yeah, okay. The color he picked was this fire red. It says it right there. Fire red. And this is what I use. But yeah. Okay, here we go. Put that right there. That one. And I already took, I took the piles off first, did a test run on those before I uh, spray painted just to see how they looked and they came out pretty good. So I will just put another light coat on this. And I will let these dry. <laughs> 15, 20 minutes. And then we will see how they uh, how they turn out, and then we'll go for the next step. All right, how we doing? We're back. So it uh, the bread ended up drying, and this is a uh, this is how it turned out. I think it turned out pretty well for my first controller painted. Um, this is how he wanted it. So uh, this is the back. I still have this covered because you don't want to get that wet with paint at all. It kind of messed up right there, but yeah, who cares? And these are the panels. So I'm going to clear coat this. I'm going to put a couple layers on this, so hopefully it'll uh, smooth it out. That's my goal. So here we go. We'll let that dry and I will come back. One eternity later. I don't know if y'all can see, but uh, this is what the, uh, the end result looks like. I think it turned out pretty, uh, pretty well. I'll be posting another one next time, but if you want to see more, like I said, like, subscribe, comment, do all the fun things. All right. We'll see you guys in the next video.